We are live along the coast. Our crews have been talking to folks who are deciding to evacuate and folks who are gearing up and going to try to ride out this storm. And that's where we find our Fox Carolina's Amber Worthy live on Folly Beach with a look at what's happening right now. And the weather has changed since we last saw you a few minutes ago, Amber. Yes, the weather has changed as well as the amount of people on the beach because when it started raining, many packed up and headed out, including the two people we interviewed just a few moments ago to head back to Gaffney. Now, we also went in town to talk to business owners who are preparing to have to pack up their businesses and board up their businesses to avoid losing any money during this storm. Now, one business owner is anticipating losing some revenue since most won't be out shopping during the storm, but she says that with her business only being three weeks old, she is taking extra precautions to keep from losing her products. She says that some great folks are helping her secure her business. Being a new business owner, it's super scary um, with loss of potential loss of revenue or product or anything like that. So it's a little nerve wracking. <laughs> we're boarding up the windows, we're filling up sandbags to place around all the windows, and um, we're taking all of our product, we'll be moving it up to higher levels so in case it floods that it doesn't get damaged. Some of the items will be taking off site um, to another location so we don't lose that. She says that she's doing some of the same things that she would do for, to secure her home, to her business. Now, hurricanes don't normally make her nervous, but again, with it being a new business, she says she's doing what she can to make sure it's secure. Now, coming up at 5.30, you're going to hear from a longtime resident of Folly Beach who says he normally stays here during the storm, and he knows what to do to be prepared to wait it out. He also talked about the community coming together to support each other during the times like this. Reporting live in Folly Beach, Amber Worthy for the 5 o'clock news.